Hey guys, Jeff from Apple. Back in the other video today, we are watching. I don't know. Just, just Hello, watch. Jay. Oh, I'm on Jay. Hello, Jay. I'm on Jay. Hello, 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 Jay. Okay, if I was allowed to zoom I in, I see a um, coin from Point First or something. Yeah. That looks like What the heck? What the funny? Okay, this is what I'm going to do. What the funny? Better work. Yes, I have that. Still. Oh, if you want to go watch that video, it's uploading now, and I got, and it's called I got it, got it, I got it. Da, 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 da. Mama, Papa, happy. Mama, da, 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 da. Mama, Papa. No, really, I actually, actually almost got um, uh, got. Come stand over here. <laughs> no, go stand over here. I'll be back. I'll be back. You gotta be kidding me. You gotta be kidding me. I then have to fix it. And it worked 30 minutes in the video. It's gonna freaking mess up. Let's go back. Couple of seconds. Yeah, would have had so many of them, but still, whatever. Let's go into the extras menu and check out the shop. What I, from what I saw, the shop is kind of pointless. I don't know. Maybe it's just me, but okay. So, oh wait, no, I didn't see this. Okay, there's actually something up here. So if you click shop on the top right, it actually brings you to this, which is exotic butters. You can buy for 350 coins, and it will appear on the desk in your office. That, that's it. Dang it. All right, well, I mean, at least we're not missing out on anything. You can just put some exotic butters on your desk, which, I mean, that is kind of cool, but it's not worth, you know, saving up 350 coins so far. And he also said there's more stuff to come in the future version. It was surprising he's still updating this game. I thought it would be done by now, but I guess not. So, of course, the other thing you can actually check out is the toys section right here. And what he also changed, which we'll get to in a second, is he changed the cheats to where you now have to pay for it, which is really unfortunate. But um, Freddy toy, Bonnie toy, Foxy toy, and Chica toy. Now, the thing I don't understand about this is these are already on your desk, I'm pretty sure. Like, if I remember correctly, they're there, but they have, they have no effect. I thought if you bought one of these, maybe, you know, you would... You would get some sort of effect with it, like it would slow down Foxy's attack or something like that, or something along those lines, but all of these are literally just things that go on your desk. I'm guessing you're going to update these two. And the weird thing is they're level two, like this one's level one, they're all level one, so maybe the more you buy them, the higher their level goes, and because of the higher level, they have like better effects. I don't know. Um, they are here though, and hopefully we'll get enough gems or you know, coins to buy one of these things. Now, here's the cool part, or I guess I don't really know if it's going to be cool or not. We have the Endless Nights mode, which if I click this, it says, Hello there. We have the, the Ghost Freddy from Vines Freddy's World. My name is Ghost Freddy, so I am here to explain what Endless Nights mode is. Or he, he said Endless Nights mode. Okay. It is so simple. You beat the night after the night. 
after night, what? You, this is, okay, it is so simple. You beat night after night. Oh, okay, and create record. If you die, you, your record, after every night, you can continue playing or back to the main. I don't, I don't think it's ling, like English is the main language. Okay, also, the animatronics will move faster every night, right? Okay, now try it by yourself. Okay, let's, let's play. I, I don't really understand what we just did, but okay. <laughs> let's just get into it. This is Endless Night Mode, all right, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see what it's all about. It has the Fight Spray's uh, world loading screen, it looks like, which is kind of weird. Okay, so we're in. I don't I don't really know what's what's going on. Okay, the music box isn't drowning at all. Or not drowning. It's not going down at all. It, it says Night 1. I'm, I'm confused already. And look, see, that's what I'm talking about, though. Look, the plushies are right there already. So like, when you buy them with coins and stuff, it's like, what, what's, what's the point? That doesn't do anything. But, okay. So, oh, I know what this is. Okay, so I think that we're basically playing through the main game, but it's endless. So if you make it to night... I did not do that, guys. It... That's not an update. Then you then get to go to night seven, that eight, nine, ten, working. so on and so forth. But what's kind of the point of that? This is just like playing through the game all over again. <laughs> Isn't it like it's literally just me playing through the game again? <laughs> There's no use to this, I don't think. I mean, yeah, we can get some tokens or whatever. I guess we'll try to survive for as long as we can, which I'm I don't think I'll end up dying because I've mastered the game, but we'll see. Alright, so as you guys know, this night doesn't really start until 2 a.m. I'm not even going to bother with the music box. I don't know if he managed to fix it or not. Like, he, he had, like, the stuff he fixed in the little pull-down bar. I didn't see, I don't remember anything about the marionette. So we might still be able to just let the marionette out, which is what I think I'm going to do because, you know, we don't we don't really need to care about the marionette, especially on the first night. Like, the first night's pretty simple, honestly. I don't even, yeah, I think Chica moves and Bonnie moves. And Bonnie attacks, like, once and then Chica attacks once. And that's really it. So this first night should be a breeze. I just want to get attacked just so I can get some coins and stuff like that. I want to buy some stuff. This camera right here looks weird to me. I don't know why. Like, it, it looks different. I'm not it, sure what, what's different about it. Oh, it yeah, it has a wire on it. Okay, I thought I heard something. A little bit weird. Also, you guys were telling me that um, apparently there was a game. It was called The Return to Freddy's 1, which I only I only played The Return to Freddy's 2. I never played any other games. I know there's like six of them or something. Like, there's a lot of them. And I guess he, like, took assets from that game, which I didn't know about. But I guess this door is from that game, which this door is still, it, it's so, it doesn't make any sense. This door, <laughs> this door is completely useless. Oh, God, the very net. Okay, let's, let's, I, I guess I'll wind it up. Why not? I don't really have to, but I guess I will. This door is completely useless, so, like, nothing... I've never seen anything appear on the other side of this door at all. Like, the, the door, is, there's no point to the door at all. Like, even if something was to appear at the door, I would just simply put down my mask and I'd be fine. <laughs> but nothing appears at the door, so it doesn't matter. The, oh, what the? Who's that? Oh, is that? Wait, is that Freddy? Oh, Freddy's moving. Okay, I didn't know that. Like, if you guys see that in the in the left left hand corner, hold on, when I go back to camera three, he's right there. He's in the top left of the, like, under the, underneath the gem right now. Look at him. Oh, God, that's creepy looking. I, I'm pretty sure that was in Fast Race 1, too, if I remember correctly. I haven't played the game in forever, though, but I'm pretty sure that was part of the game. That was one of the cool things about that game was there's always, like, new things you could find. Like, you, you know, like, sometimes on your first playthrough, you might not see Freddy there, but on your second one... I love you, Jamie. Don't... see him there and he just looks super creepy because you're in such a panic your first playthrough you don't know what to do oh god okay let's uh wind that up again let's let's not die to the marionette so i think this is weird i'm confused because I, I guess endless night is something different but i think it's the same it's just the same game that we played the first time but um uh, you know this time it's just endless <laughs> which once again i don't understand the point of that and but it also looks like he's changed the attack pattern of the animatronics on this night which is interesting because Freddy didn't attack on, uh, oh my god, that was so close. Freddy didn't attack on that night before, but now he is. Oh god, oh, and the troll chick is here too, okay. So it looks like it's like all of the animatronics, but, oh god, wait, did the marionette get out? No, okay, I thought he did, that was my toxic bar. Got a little worried right there. Alright, cool, got rid of her. Now we gotta check on Freddy again, let's see if he's, he's still there, 3am. 
I really don't think we're going to lose on this night unless the marionette kills us like he can. Oh, what the? <laughs> that scared me. My mask just suddenly went down. I didn't know what to do. Oh, I got two gems from that. We need, what was it, 350, I think? Oh, no, no, no. Okay, I think it was 30 to, to get the little plushies. But if I wanted, like, the, the exotic butters, I would need coins for that. But, okay, so cool. We got two so far. So if we just get jump scared, like, like 20 more times, we could actually get, you know, get a nice little prize for ourselves. And by a nice little prize, I mean a, a plush that we, I think we already have right here. Is the, the Chica plush, which is thir or 20 or 30, is literally right there on our desk. I don't know what's up with that, but I, I need to find out, all right? I need to purchase one and see if it does anything. But, which I'm trying to figure out, like, if we can do that on this, you know, this endless night mode. But so far, it's, it's pretty empty. Which then again, it is night one, but I think our best bet to get these, these gems and stuff like that is to go on to the custom night and set it to where, like, the animatronic attacks constantly. Like, let's say we set Chica to 900, even though on 900 she was still the same <laughs> as she was at, like, normal difficulty, which is weird. But if we set Chica to, like, a higher a higher mark, then she would just constantly attack, and we would just constantly get coins and stuff like that. So it's a win-win. Oh, crap, I didn't even realize our power actually is very low. We're at 28% 4 a.m. This is a bit of a problem. I'm going to need to calm it down on the power. Okay, uh, Marionette's going to get out if, if this chick doesn't go away. Yeah, Marionette is definitely going to get out. Oh, got out. All right, well, not, nothing I can do there. 5 a.m., 27% battery. We just have to hope that the Marionette won't attack me right now. I, I hope he didn't patch it, but really, I have a feeling he might have. But we can hope, all right? Let's just not check the cameras, obviously. We're up to four gems, too, from that one attack. Cool, so yeah, every attack we get two gems. So what do you need, like 10 attacks, something like that? That'd be like, what, 20? So, I mean, I don't know. We need, we need a decent amount of attacks, but still... Um, I think we can do it before probably night three and have enough to- What? Oh, okay, yeah, he fixed the marionette. That, that's great. You know, he, he fixed it. That, that's unfortunate. Okay, let's go watch something <laughs> Dang else. It. You so know how much harder this die? game is now that he fixed that? Oh my god. I'm just a weird person, people. Please. No. You're good. I knew that guy died. Good down there. Why did I even scrap for these people? I tried to again. Yeah, my card is just my friend. But why in the world? What in the thing? Okay, if you want me to watch that, please leave me a like or comment down below in 3, 2, 1.